Next, I'm going to discuss about the dry end method of this program. So if you debug the code, control comes to main function here after that coincident. So here I have taken five integer variable. First is a over r. Uh, so right here I have given the size 25. So you can enter maximum 25 elements in the array. And uh, next is i. j n and tan so here after control comes to printer function so what when double code so this or display into the output scheme enter the number and whatever i'm going to enter so that received by n so i'm going to enter n value 5 so here after control comes to uh, this point, print f, enter the array elements. So this or uh, display into the output screen and i value start from 0. So add here, check the condition 0 less than 5, condition is true, so that go inside. So it over all of 0 position, I'm going to enter 7. A scanner function so this store the number percent d because uh, it or r is integer time here after that go up and increase the value of i so i become one check the condition one less than five condition is two so it or r of one position let's enter the number nine i gonna increase by one so i is two now Check the condition 2 less than 5, condition is 2. So 8 over R of 2 position. Let's enter the number 5. Hereafter, I gonna increase, so I become 3 now. Check the condition 3 less than uh, 5, condition is 2. So 8 over R of 3 position. I'm going to enter number 6. And I gonna increase, so I become 4 now. Check the condition, 4 less than 5, condition is true. So, 8 over out of 4 position. Let's enter number 4. Now, here after I gonna increase by 1, so I become 5 now. Check the condition, 5 less than 5, condition is not true. So, control comes to this point. And here 4, I start from 0. Check the condition 0, n minus 1. So 5 minus 1, the value come 4. So 0 less than 4, condition is true. So that go inside. At here, j start from 0. And j, n minus i minus 1. So n value is now 5, i value 0. And minus 1, so the value total come 4. So 0 less than 4, condition is true. So that go inside. So right here, a double r of j value is uh, 0 greater than a double r of 0 plus 1. So 0 position 7 is there and 1 position 9 is there. So 7 greater than 9. So first I am going to do the indexing. So a double r size total 25. So add here. This is a uh, zero position. This is one, two, three, and four. Seven, nine, five. Next to a six and four. So maximum. Index is 24 because size I have given 25. So rest are null character store. So right here, 8 over r of 0 greater than 8 over r of 0 plus 1 means 1 plus 7 greater than 9. Condition is not true. So that not go inside. So from here, that go up and increase the value of j. So j become 1. Check the condition 1 less than 4. So this value is now 4. 5 minus. 0 minus 1. So this value 4. 
So I have one less than four condition is true. So a double all of one greater than a double all of one plus one. So one position we have nine and one plus one two. So two position five. So I have a double all of one position value go to ten. So one position nine that go to ten. And a double all of one plus one means two position value go to a double all of one. So this position come five. Here that, and next time go to a double all of one means one plus one two position restore nine. So hereafter again, or oh, that go up and increase the value of j. So j become two now. So add your new array elements are. Seven, five, nine, six, and four. So this is zero index one, two, three, and four. Here after j is going to increase, so j is two now. Check the condition two less than four. Condition is true. So I have a double out of two greater than a double out of two plus one. So two value is now nine and two plus one three. So nine greater than six condition is two. So a double out of two position value go to ten. So two position nine, nine go to ten, and a double out of two plus one go to a double out of two. So this uh, six value comes to this point. And ten value go to a double out of two plus one means three position. So this position is true. Yeah. Now here after j gonna increase by one, so j is three now. So I have new array elements are seven, five, nine, six, and four. So this is zero index one, two. Three, four. So here are two. Oh, check the condition. Three less than four. Condition is true. So that coincides. If a double out of three greater than a double out of three plus one. So three position we have nine and three plus one four position four. Nine greater than four. Condition is true. So a double out of three position value go to ten. So three position nine is there. So that go to ten. And at here eight or three plus one four position value go to three, so four comes to this point, and ten go to oh, eight or four position. So here after check on increase by one, so j is now four. Check the condition four less than four condition is not two, so that not go inside. So at here new array elements are seven, five. Five, six. So this one. So this position come four, and in last that is to nine. So here condition false. So that not go inside. Now control comes to this point. Here after that go up and increase the value of i. So i become zero to one. Check the condition one less than four. Condition is true. So that go inside. J value start from zero. Check the condition. N minus i minus one. So five minus i value is one minus one. So this value come three. And or check the condition zero less than three. Condition is true. So a double out of zero position greater than a double out of zero plus one. So this is zero position. This is one, two, three, four. So a double out of zero position is now seven, and zero plus one. One, so it or all of zero plus one seven greater than five condition is true, so that coincide. So it or all of zero plus one value go to ten. So zero plus one seven that go to ten. And it or all of zero plus one means one plus one value go to it or all of zero. So at here this position is true five. And ten value go to it or all of one plus one. So same position that go. Seven go to eight double out of one position. So new array elements are oh five seven six. 
six, four, and in last nine. Here after that go up and increase the value of j. So j become one now. Check the condition one less than three. Condition is true. So at a if a double out of one position. So this is one, two, three, four, zero. So a double out of one position greater than a double out of two. One plus one two. So one position or uh, seven and or uh, two position six. The condition is true. So that coincide. So eight out of one position value go to ten. So seven go to ten, and eight out of two position one plus one two position value go to eight out of one. So this position is true six. Here after ten go to eight out of j plus one means ten seven go to two position. So new array elements are five, and on uh, this value set. So this. One position comes six, next or uh, seven, next four, and next nine. Here after that, go up and increase the value of j. So j become two now. J the condition two less than three. Condition is true. So a double or of two position greater than a double or of two plus one three. So this is zero, one, two, three, four. So two position we have seven and uh, three position nine. So seven greater than sorry seven greater than four. So three position four is there. So condition is true. So eight or or uh, two position value go to ten. So two position seven seven go to ten and eight or or uh, three position value go to eight or or uh, two. So three position value go to eight or or uh, two. So this position is true seven and ten go to eight or or uh, two plus one three. So seven go to this point. So add your new array elements are five, six, and this position come four, and here seven, and in last that is to nine. Here after j gonna increase by one. So check the condition three less than or three condition is not true. So that not coincide. Here after that, go up and increase the value of i. So i become two now. So at your check the condition two less than or five. Condition is true. So j value start from zero again. And at your check the condition zero less than n five minus two minus one. So this value come three five minus three two. So at your this is now two. So zero less than Two condition is true, so that coincides. So at your a double out of zero greater than a double out of one. So zero position five, one position six, two, four, three, and four. So at your or zero position we have five and or six position one position six. So the condition is not true. Five greater than six, that's not true. So that increase the value of j. So j is now one. So add here. Check the condition. A double out of or uh, one position greater than a double out of two. So one position we have or uh, six and or uh, two position four. So six greater than four. Condition is true. So add here a double out of one position value go to ten. So six go to ten and a double out of two. Position value go to a double out of one, so two position four. So this position come, one position come four. Here after time value go to a double out of. Oh, j value is now one one plus one two. So two position store time. So time is now six. So two position that is two six. Here after. New array elements are five, six, sorry, four, six, seven, and in last nine, five, six, oh, five, four. This is uh, five, four, six, seven, nine. Now here after j gonna increase by one, so j is two now. Check the condition two less than two. Condition is not true, so that not coincide. 
Here after that, go up and increase the value of i. So i become 3 now. Check the condition 3 less than 5, condition is true. So j start from 0 and add here 0 less than or 5 minus. So i value is now 3. 5 minus 3 minus 1. So this value come 1. So add here, check the condition 0 less than 1, condition is 2. So that coincide. So add here. A double out of 0 position greater than A double out of 0 plus 1. So 0 position we have 5 and 1 position 4. So 5 greater than 4 condition is 2. So A double out of 0 position value go to tan. So 0 position is stored. 0 position we have 5. So 5 go to tan. And now here after a double out of 0 plus 1 means 1 position value go to A double out of 0. So 1 position 4 is there, 4 go to 0 position. And time go to 0 plus 1 means 1 position. So time value is now 5. So this comes to there. So here after that go up and increase the value of J. So J become 0 to 1. Check the condition 1 less than 1. Condition is not true. So that not go inside. So here after that come and increase the value of i. So i become 3 to 4. Check the condition. Uh, 4 less than 5 minus 1. 4. 4 less than 4. Condition is not true. So control comes to this point. So new array elements are. This position is stored 4. Next 5. Next 6. Next 7 and next 9. So this uh, display into the output screen, sorted array. So I draw i value start from, so this is 0 index, 1, 2, 3, 4. So I draw 0 less than n value, 5. Condition is true. So that coincides. So percentage because a double r. So this is integer. So slash n. So it, it print the value in new line. So zero position we have uh, four. So this our display here after that go up and increase the value of i. So i become first time zero. Next one check the condition one less than five. Condition is two. So it will out of one position five. So this our display again i gonna increase by one. So i become two now. Check the condition two less than five. Condition is two. So it will out of two position six. So this our display. So at here i gonna increase by one. So i is three now. Check the condition 3 less than 5, condition is true. So, a double out of 3 position that print the value. So, 7, so 7 display. i gonna increase by 1, so i is 4 now. Check the condition 4 less than 5, condition is true. So, 4 position we have 9, so this our display. So, here after i become 5. Check the condition 5 less than 5, condition is not true. So, that not print anything. Not coincident. Here after that out for main function. So this is the drawing method of this program. So final output we have 4, 5, 6, 7, 9. So this is an ascending order. So this is the example. This is a drawing method of bubble sort. So I hope guys you understand. So thanks for watching. See you next week.